Hi, it's Adrian. How are you doing today? And so I'm actually back with um, trying out some of the Luxi products, L-O-O-X-I. And I've been saying Loxi, and I think it's Luxi, so really sorry if I've been going ahead and mispronouncing that. Um, again, I... I've been playing with their shimmers and they're just so much fun that I'm back with another video. I just got back from the grocery store. I went to three grocery stores, so I'm a little winded at this point, but, um, and I had this makeup on while I went there. So the only thing that I reapplied was the lip gloss and that's the NYX, the Better Gloss in Snow Cone. So pretty fuchsia color there. And um, everything else has been to three grocery stores. And I guess I'll go ahead and start with what I have on for my base. Super Goop Glow Oil SPF 50 is what I have on there. As far as what I did for the, um, the actual foundation, I mixed two together. So I had the Maybelline Super Stay C Plus. Um, in shade 102, which I think is their lightest. And then I went ahead and mixed that with the Beauty Bay Glow Filter. So I had these two on today. And this one's in shade 2. It actually, for me, gives me a little bit more of a bronze kind of look. A whole bunch of glow, a little bit of bronze. And um, so that's kind of what that adds to this. So, um, and a little bit of moisture as well. And then as far as what I did for my bronzer today, I got out the Heat Wave Sunrise. And um, this is one of my favorite all-time bronzers. This, uh, the MAC one, I, I like them both. I don't think I could pick and uh, one over the other. You just have to have both, you know? I did use the Bare Minerals. And this is the Kiss of Rose. And so that's what I have on as my blush today. And um, I did go ahead and put on a little bit of the Out of Quartz um, by ColourPop to go ahead and do a little bit of a highlighter. It's actually a super shock cheek, but I use it as a highlighter. And then getting to the experiment for today. And with the look -see, eyeshadows. Again, I'm still not sure how to pronounce that. Um, I tried them on a black base, and I had a black base um, from Profusion, which is just a cream eyeshadow that, you know, dries. And actually, it, does, it dries more gray than black. But And they look amazing over that base. Well, I was watching some YouTube videos, and the color case by uh, Mama -ma Mitchell um, was on one of the videos, and I remembered that I have this. And this is actually going to be a, um, well, it's an eyeshadow that's all matte. If you've done theatrical work, it does remind me of grease paint, not it doesn't have the exact consistency, but the way that it dries matte and it dries opaque just really reminds me of it. So, um, yeah, this is uh, the base that I went ahead and used. And so I went ahead and used this color and the purple color. Let me get some of the purple out here. Just swatch of that. And these... Um, so these are the two colors I have on the base for the Luxie Loxie. Um, now I'm confused myself. But these are the two colors that I have on. Um, and then I have the duochromes. They're part of the Aurora collection. And I have two of those on top of this. And let me show you which ones here. Do not drop these eyeshadows. I dropped red hot. It was not a good thing to have done. But um, let's see. So over the purple shadow, I have the feels and um, really pretty duochrome. It has uh, some gray, some blue, some purple, and um, really pretty there. 
so that's what and that I have on the outside of the lid here and then this really pretty turquoise color I have a splash over that and splash is really pretty it definitely has green and gray in it um, I think it may have some purple in it as well and so I went ahead and put the duochromes over uh, the Made by Mitchell and again the Made by Mitchell is a color case with these ones you can get these on Beauty Bay um, I usually they're supposed to run about forty dollars but if you get them on sale on Beauty Bay then or the Beauty Bay website usually you can get them for twenty eight thirty two it depends you know but uh, Beauty Bay is the only place that I know of where you can find those. And um, as far as the way that the look turned out, here's the way that the eyeshadow. And I definitely think that you need a base for these ones. Um, they just, the ones that I've purchased, and I've only gotten five, but um, the ones that I got all have... Um, a lot of silvery shimmer in them and so in order to go ahead and get the actual duochromes the different colors to come out um, I find putting them on a base because otherwise when I look at them um, without a base they just look like uh, gray and white shimmer to me and so putting them on a base really helps and so um, I really like the formula of Loxy, Luxy. Um, they're beautiful eyeshadows and I'm definitely getting more and um, I've had a great time trying to figure out how to make them work best. So uh, yeah, I think that they're just really fun. I did go ahead and use an MRI eyeliner as well with this. and. Um, Again, I got the Sky High pack, so I'm using both the primer and the mascara from Sky High Maybelline. And I also have on the uh, Essence Thick and Wow and Caramel Blonde. So, that's sort of the way that the look turned out today, and I think it turned out really fun. And I actually got some compliments on it when I was out at my three different grocery stores today. So uh, that's a look. That's the experiment. And yeah, I think um, for having gone through a workout with me going to all these different places, um, the, this formula and this combination, the map made by Mitchell and the Loxy, Luxy eyeshadows. They work really well together. They look as vibrant as when I put them on. So if you want to go and look out in sparkly makeup, this makeup will stay. And um, other than that, I think that's the whole video. I hope that you have a great day and I'll see you later. Bye.